Glad you came back for another night. I'll promise it'll be a lot more interesting this time. We found some great new relics over the weekend, and we're tracking down a new lead right now. So, uh, let me just give you an update real quick, then you can get back to work. Like, the attractions opens in like a week, so we have to make sure everything works and nothing catches on fire! And, uh, when the place opens, people will come to the opposite side of the building and work their way towards you, then pass through and out the exit. Uh, yeah, you've officially become part of the attraction. Uh, you'll be serving as the security guard, so you're not only will be monitoring the people and the cameras as they go through, you know, to make sure no one steals anything or makes out in the corner, but you'll also be a part of the show. It'll make it feel really authentic, I think. Uh, now let me go over what's new. We found another set of drawings, always nice, and a foxy head, which we might think is authentic, but then again, it might just be another crappy cosplay. And we found a desk fan, very old school metal though, so watch the fingers. <laughs> uh, now, the place is basically, you know, just flashing lights, spooky props. Uh, I honestly thought we would have more by now. Uh, we don't have anything really cool by the next week. We may have to put you up in a furry suit and walk around saying, boo. <laughs> uh, but you know, like we said, we're trying to track down a good lead right now. Uh, some guy who helped design one of the buildings says there was like an extra room that got bored up or uh, something like that. So we're gonna take a peek and see what we can find. Uh, for now, just get comfortable with the new setup. Check your security camera by the right, the click of that blue button. You can toggle between the hall cams and the vent cams. And over to your far left, you can see and flip open your maintenance panel. You know, use this to reboot any system that may go offline. <laughs> so, in trying to make the place feel really vintage, we may have overdone it a bit. <laughs> Some of this equipment is barely functional. Yeah, I wasn't joking about the fire. That, that That's a real risk. Uh, that's the most important thing you'll need to watch out for the ventilation. Look, this place will give you the spooks, man. And if you let that ventilation go offline, you'll start seeing some crazy stuff. So keep that air flowing. Okay, keep an eye on things, and we'll have to try to see if we can find something new for you tomorrow night. speakers if you will walk in the attraction. Dude, that would make things feel legit, man. But I have an even better surprise for you, and you're not gonna like this. We found one. 
A real one. Uh, okay, I gotta go, man. Uh, well, look, it it's in there somewhere. I'm sure you'll see it. Okay, I I'll leave you with some of this great audio that I found. Talk to you later, man. Uh, hello. Hello, hello. Uh, welcome to your new career as a performer slash entertainer for Freddy Fazbear's Pizza. Uh, these days will provide you with much needed information Hi. on how to handle slash climb into slash climb out of mascot costumes. So please pay close attention while learning how to operate these suits as accidents slash injuries slash death slash irreparable and grotesque maiming can occur. First and most discussed is how to operate the mascots while in animatronic form. For ease of operations, the animatronics are set to turn and walk towards sounds they hear, which is an easy and hands-free approach to make sure the animatronics stay where the children are for maximum entertainment slash crowd-pleasing value. To change the animatronic to suit mode, insert and turn firmly the hand crank provided by the manufacturer. Turning the crank will recoil and compress the animatronic parts around the sides of the suit, providing room to climb inside. Please make sure the spring locks are fastened tight to ensure the animatronic devices remain safe. We'll cover this in more detail in tomorrow's session. Remember to smile, you are the base of Freddy Fazbear's Pizza.
touch or press against any of the spring locks inside the suit. Do not touch the spring locks at any time. Do not breathe on the spring locks as moisture may loosen them and cause them to break loose. In the case that the spring locks come loose while you are wearing the suit, please try to maneuver away from populated areas before bleeding out, as to not ruin the customer's experience. As always, if 